I dream. I dream of a place that will teach me to create. A place that will channel my God-given talents. A place that will unleash my full potential. 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 I dream of a place that will make my dreams come true. Extremely primitive. We had this old the Moviola. Have you ever heard about a Moviola? It's mm -hmm. one of these upright editing machines that we work with pedals like the sewing machine. And it goes, it just rolls of films and bins. Then gradually over the years we improved the course, we got budgets, we got better equipment. As the lecturers uh, became more and more specialized, the course improved, the equipment improved. Um, imagination and creativity is the basis of all great artistic expression. That is why we concentrate on developing techniques that will support the student in developing his or her own creative talents. By the end of the course, he has a basic knowledge of the whole filmmaking process, but then can also specialize in any of the many, many um, specialized fields. Yeah, the first time I, want to, I came to Pretoria Tech, I wanted to be an actor. But, uh, you know, learning this thing, uh, they taught us from pre-production to post-production. So I enjoy post-production much all the time. I have a passion. If I have to live million years or if I have to come back again to study again, I'll try editing because it's fun. I love it. You know, it's like, oh boy. I thought my fault for class of doing the cut from the camera itself. So. Pikkie hier speel, pikkie daar speel. Pa, moet op pa's ook die camera kom. <laughs> Foto's neem of pa wil die video weer kom. Of my video maak vandag. It's not easy to get selected. Some years we get up to 800 applications and we only take 25. We only take students with true talent and a burning passion. When the students start out, they know very little about filmmaking. In fact, some of them don't even know how to operate an enzymatic camera. Within about 10 months, you can choose to be very finely tuned with sound, to be very technical, to be very physical, to run around, climb mountains or whatever with a camera on your shoulder. You can be creative in your mind in terms of a director and create these fantastic things. You can be very artistic. You can sit working with computers behind a computer all day and create the entire scene. To be a film student, you, you're basically becoming like a little demigod of your own little universe. You can do what you want, you can create people, you can kill them off, you can do anything. I always wanted to make movies and when I was about standard 7, I saw um, a program on the film school students on TV. So there's the correct composition. 
you must have a little bit more looking space in front of the, the person than behind his head. Can you all see that? You know, it's always amazing. I think you can always tell an ex-form school student on set because as an overall package is better informed and therefore makes for a more valuable crew member on set. There were some unbelievably talented people, uh, Grant Waterston, Robin Mountford, Alan um, Haley. Uh, people like Bernard Joffer has been nominated for an Oscar award. Angus Gibson was nominated for an Oscar award. Steven Spielberg has actually contracted ex-students Zeidel and Waterston to produce documentaries of of the Holocaust victims. I had worked with Steven Spielberg on a project that had been for three years and it was three years of my life that I dedicated to this project. When it all comes down and it all falls apart and there's no way to win you're left with a broken heart And you can't look down Cause it's too far to fall And you can't look forward to nothing Except looking back upon it all Look up And cry out You both been waiting for this day for a long 